Hello everyone, Fixer here, and today I have for you a game called Kindergarten. It was developed by Connor Boyle and Sean Young and published by Smash Games. Now, Smash Games already has two pretty successful indie games under their belt. They had Magicite back in 2014, and last year they had Roguelands, which was uh, pretty popular on YouTube and Twitch. So this is their third offering, Kindergarten. It is in early access. You can get it right now on Steam for five bucks. And um, according to that, it's only going to be in early access for one or two weeks. The game is pretty much complete, but there's still bugs involved. Uh, but you can play it from beginning to end. And I've already played, I don't know, maybe 10 minutes of the game just to make sure it was something I wanted to play. Because I, 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 I found this while browsing Steam's upcoming games, which I do almost daily. And I came across this, I'm like, what the hell is this game? And I'm not sure I could put a, together a better description than what's on Steam. It says it's an, a, an abstract puzzle adventure where you play as a student in a school that's a bit off. And the teacher is trying to get rid of her kids. The janitor is frequently seen cleaning up blood. And the cafeteria is serving the same slop over and over again. The kids are walking around with strange devices planted on them after visiting the principal. And one of your fellow classmates has gone missing. It's up to you to figure out what's going on because your life might depend on it. So yeah, quite a weird game. And I thought, you know what, I gotta put this on video because I think you guys would get a kick out of it. So I guess let's get started. It's Monday! And that's me! I love I love the, the little Pixar. It's got a little bit of the Pixel Privateer, Pixel Pirates uh, look to it. Um, Alright, so... This is our cash on hand, and we do have a piggy bank here, which we can access. And I will... I'll take a buck out of there. Not, not more than a buck. Just about. There we go. And these are my actions for this particular stage of the game. These apples down here. I can perform three actions. Once that is done, it moves to the next stage of the game. What is the ultimate goal? I'm not even sure. Survive, I think it is? <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, I don't know what all these things are. These may be things I have to accomplish. Achievements. Who the hell knows? This game is really bizarre, I'm telling you. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Yes, I am. Alright, so these are all the kids in the class. This is our crazy-ass teacher and the crazy-ass janitor. I have five actions that I can perform while we're out here in the yard before it moves to the next stage. And actions could be maybe doing a quest for one of these kids. And the quests are pretty simple, like putting a gum in another kid's hair, things like that. Um, let's, let's meet the kids and see, um, see what kind of craziness we have. Screw off, kid, I'm busy. No problem. Hi, my friends call me Nugget. Or they would if I had any. Nugget knows no love or friendship since Billy went missing. Got a typo here. Um, what happened to Billy? See, this apple tells you it's going to take an action to do this. Um, you'll get none from me. I'll be his friend. What is your offering? <laughs> offering? You must offer something to prove your friendship to Nugget. Maybe that's why you don't have more friends. I have only friendship, yo. Perhaps that is all Nugget needs. You may have Nugget's Nugget. It signifies our friendship. Wow, thanks. Do not consume the Nugget of friendship for with its digestion. <laughs> so too is our friendship digested. Good, Nugget will see you later, friend. Gotcha. No more talking now. Shoot. No problem, kid. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Want to be my boyfriend? Yeah, that's that's a little forward. No. Oh, okay. Oh. Um. Hey, I'm Lily. You've probably heard about what happened to my brother, Billy. Nope. You haven't? Well, it's been all over the news. He went missing a few days ago. I'm sorry to hear that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even sees the, seems to care. Ever since he went missing, people either ignore me or insult me. Cindy has been trying to put gum in my hair. Why? That's that little bitch. I don't know, but if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's really mean. I've got another typo here. Thanks for the tip. Okay, strange. I love this kid. I love his glasses. He is so adorable. 
I'm Monty. If you need something, come talk to me. Odds are I can get it for you for the right price. This, <laughs> so this guy is the red of, of the school. What I need and what I sell changes throughout the day, so come see me often. Um, I want to buy something. Here's what's for sale. A yo-yo cigarettes, a voice recorder, a screwdriver, never mind. Huh, this is a man who knows how to get things. He does have quite a variety of, of uh, products here. I don't know what would be important. Um, a yo-yo. Screwdriver sounds like it, co it could come in handy at one point, right? Yo-yo, I don't see. Cigarettes might get me to buy something from another kid. I don't know. I think I'm gonna go with a screwdriver. Got the sucker off a janitor for a steal. It's weird that he's willing to sell me the tools provided by the school, but I ain't complaining. It'll run you a buck. It's a deal. Pleasure doing business with you. Alright, I don't need anything else. I'm Jerome. I don't think you're cool enough to talk to me. Whatever, jerk. Wow. Alright, let's talk to the teacher. I'm Mrs. Applegate. I've been well endowed <clears throat> with excellent teaching qualities. You sure have. That's it? Okay, good. Um, janitor, there we go. How you doing there, Sonny? Don't mind the old janitor here, just sweeping up after you silly cretins. Sweepy, sweepy, sweepy. Um, that's a mop. Ah, well, so it is. You're also mopping the sidewalk. I'll be mopping your blood off it if you don't skedaddle. I don't want to skedaddle. I'm a man of my word. Oh, are you gonna kill me? Warnings lightly. Wow. Well, I mean, <laughs> so in in my in my in my ten minutes of play time before I started this recording, I didn't do that. <laughs> I had no idea that was coming. I had no idea that was a thing. Um, let's restart the room, I suppose. Does that mean I have to talk to everybody again? Screw off, kid. Well, that's all he told me the first time. Oh, I don't have anything anything in my inventory. All right, so let's let's speed through this. Um, I only have friendship. I don't know what the difference is between gold and white, as far as the options here go. All right, no more talking. Yeah, okay, get out of here. And you? No, I don't want to be your boyfriend. And you're gonna tell me how awful she is? Um, no, I haven't. So, my memory, everything completely resets that I accomplished in here. Okay. Uh, thanks for the tip. And you... Um, I'll, I'll buy that, I'll buy that screwdriver again. And I won't piss off the janitor this time. Thank you. Anything I don't know. Okay. And Jerome, he's a dick. And you! Um, that's a mop. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, you're mopping the sidewalk. I will skedaddle this time. Great, so I got three actions left. And I, I know I can continue my conversation with her. I can become her boyfriend or no. Or I can end the day. I don't know how to end the day exactly. Sure. That's what I like to hear, and we'll totally be the cutest couple in school. But first, you have to do something for me. Um. Oh, I see. Yellow is just what is default selected. I thought it meant something different. Okay. Well, good to know. Isn't our love enough? <laughs> That's cute. But no, it isn't. You're going to have to prove it to me. Um. How do I do that? You see that girl over there? That's Lily. She is by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you'll ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time. Got it? Yeah. Oh, yay! This is going to be so great. She'll finally get what she deserves, just like her brother did for dumping me. Come find me for morning time after you've done it. Um, uh, what happened to her brother? You haven't heard? He went missing. His disappearance totally stole the thunder from my dog. Biscuit going missing. I guess everyone just cares more about him than they do about me. Your dog went missing too? Yeah, I, I brought her in for show and tell, but the janitor says said dogs aren't allowed, so he took her. 
Apparently she escaped from his closet and they couldn't find her. Um, about that janitor, he probably killed your dog. Oh, I got actual gum in my inventory. Maybe I could find your dog instead. Huh. Interesting proposal. I do miss Biscuit. Question is, do I love Biscuit more than I hate Lily? Apparently you hate Lily more. Yeah, Lily is actually a despis despicable person and her existence bothers me. Don't worry about Biscuit. Just put that gum in her hair during morning time and come talk to me afterward. Holy shit. Alright, so you got a planner, which is basically your to-do list. Simple enough. Um, I have two actions left and I don't know exactly how to progress the day without my actions because I don't I don't think I have any more actions that I can perform besides obviously putting gum in her hair will you talk to me now no you screw off I don't I don't really want to put gum in her hair um she can be pretty mean yeah I know so this <laughs> is putting the gum in her hair <sighs> I don't want to be mean to the girl that's got a missing brother got it Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how do I progress the day without using my actions? Because I don't want to put gum in this girl's hair. And I wonder if there's a way... I don't think there's a way to actually use your inventory. It just will pop up in the options over there. Um, there is one way I know to progress, and that is to... You can use your action to pull from your bank. Kind of like a wire transfer. And you do it by hitting this key. Bam. Bam. So you get a quarter for every apple, or whatever. And I know that progresses the day, but again, I don't really want to put gum in this poor girl's hair. So I think, um, I think I'm gonna pass on that. And I don't need another item, do I? I don't think so, but I'll, I'll use this to pull money out. Okay, children, it's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Good morning, children! It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time. Or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone, as long as you're the best you can be. <laughs> Alright, go find a partner. Let's talk to these jerks. This guy's probably got more stuff, right? What? You want to be my morning buddy? I ain't got time for that nonsense. So unless you're buying or selling something, get lost. Does he have anything different? Yeah, he has fewer options. Okay. Nothing. Jerome? Dude, you know you're not cool enough to talk to me, let alone be my morning buddy. Besides, Monty is going to hook me up with a sweet yo-yo. <gasps> I could buy that yo-yo and give it to him. Whatever, jerk. Oh, I don't really do the whole morning buddy thing anymore. My brother Billy was my normal buddy, but he's missing. Put gum at least. Wow, I still have an option to do it. Whoa. Hey, don't go snooping around other people's cubbies. Okay, so that looks like a... Oh, is that a book or something? I don't know. Money... <laughs> a, a, a knife? Is that a knife? A magnifying glass? All right, there's a nugget. What's this? All right, she's just going to crab at me. There's a dollhouse. I can't do anything with it. All right, let's check out my friend. Nugget does not wish to spend morning time with you. Nugget is very busy. What are you busy with? You are curious about the ways of Nugget? Interesting. Perhaps you could be of some use to Nugget. Nugget is in need of a magnifying glass. Do this for Nugget before the next bell rings and you will be rewarded. Okay, so that's the magnifying glass. Lovely. Alright, let's check this chick out. Well, what are you waiting for? Stick that gum in her hair. Oh, I don't want to do it. Why the hell do you think I want to be your morning buddy? That's a good point. So at this point, it looks to me like I either need to find a way to get the magnifying glass, which she's probably going to Oh, I don't even have an option to... Okay, whatever. Or I can buy the yo-yo. I don't know how else I can get the magnifying glass. Is there anything... Oh, can I talk to the teacher? Go find a morning buddy or you'll be an outcast loser like Nuggets. Holy shit. Alright. I would like to get the magnifying glass, but I don't know how to. Can I go anywhere else? No. Can I leave? Oh, no, no, no. You can't just leave class without a pass. Can I use the bathroom? Uh, I don't know. Can you? Well, may I use the bathroom? Of course, now that you've asked correctly, here's the bathroom pass. <gasps> just be back soon. 
Lovely. Oh shit. <laughs> Not so fast there, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass. Oh crap, that takes a, an apple. Okay, I'll let you pass, but I can't let you go any further than the bathroom. That's fair. Oh, that's hilarious. Look at him. Alright. Oh, sh- <laughs> What the- What is going on here? Hey, don't you go messing around with those bags. Now that I know that he can get violent? Yeah. It's a sink. Oh, lovely. What do you have to say for yourself? <laughs> What's going on there, boy? Oh, that's creepy. Um... I don't know if I want to ask what's in those bags. Well, what's in those bags? What bags? I don't see no bags. Alright, I'm not gonna press him, I don't... Okay, I'll press him a little. Oh, these bags! Nothing for you to worry your stupid little head about. Now run along! Alright, I'm gonna stop worrying my stupid little head. We know what happens. Door won't budge, someone must be in there. I can hear someone grunting on the other side of the door. It must be in use. Oh, disgusting. This toilet is disgusting. There's no way I can use it. What do I do here? Besides get killed by the janitor. I don't... <sighs> it's bleeding. Oh, yes, the uh, bleeding. Say, did you know I'm required by law to stay at least one mop's length away from children at all times? Um, how did that judgment get passed down? Get at least one mop length away from the janitor. Good idea. Oh! It's funny how much I want to push this. How did that judgment get passed down? You still bothered by, about my tale that ends with someone on the end of a mop? Um... It sounds riveting. It is, but that's a tale for another time. Oh my god. I feel like it's giving me like a shitload of chances to get out of this situation before I die. I'm morbidly curious. That sounds bad. I'm going to play it safe now. I feel like I've pushed it to the limit. Um, I would like to get by, please. Can I get the exclamation point on him again or no? No? God damn it. Um... Oh, that's what I need right there. Let me bag, jerk. Fine. All right. Oh, you're back. I'll take that bathroom pass back now. Go back to your morning time. All right, so it appears to me... I, I only My only option is... The yo-yo, right? What else? Did, I could buy cigarettes... Oh, and you know what? I only got three apples. All right, so let's do two. Oh, is this going to... Oh, wait, that's not the right kid. This is the right kid. What am I doing? This is going to cost me an apple, isn't it? Oh, no, it's not. Oh, it is. Oh, no. Okay, well, that was a waste. Because if I do this, then I don't have a buddy. Shit. How do I get that magnifying glass? Is there no other way? What have I... I haven't... Does she say that for everything? Pretty much. I could just put the gum in this girl's hair. That will end the morning as well. Oh no. I'm screwed. All right. Again, I need a way to end the day without just taking money out of my bank, but I don't know if there is a bonus for keeping money in the bank or not. I think, um, I think I'm screwed either way. The hall pass thing was pretty useless to me, wasn't it? Alright, well, I'm just going to end the day because if I, if I buy the yo-yo, it'll end the day anyways. So let's just grab the damn... Well, you know what? Let's grab cigarettes, because I don't know if the yo-yo is going to be useful from this point on. This might be its only use. So I'm going to grab the cigarettes. Uh, yeah. 
Just don't go showing him to anyone. It could get us both in trouble. Understood. And nothing right now. Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go down the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. Uh, a nutritious meal. I hear that we were having slop today. How exciting. And I failed. Holy cow, look at that cook. And the janitor sells biscuits. You're nowhere near cool enough to sit with us. Get lost. I don't want to sit with you anyway. No way a worm like you is going to be sitting with me. Jesus Christ. Oh, this girl's going to be mad. Sorry, sweetie. We're through. Better luck tomorrow. What do you have to sell there, chief? Um, I figured you'd be seeing me around. Slop is no good, and I don't think anyone is brave enough to try a biscuit. Spell biscuit around there. From the janitor. Dumb old man can't even spell it right. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> he put it in quotes. I guess I should have uh, saw that. A McGlob silly meal and a salad. Alright. Let's go talk to Lily. Stupid tables. Please don't sit with me. I don't want to talk to anyone until they find my brother. Jesus Christ. So moody. No one ever sits with poor Nugget. Nugget does not have any friends. I, I've got your Nugget right here there, Chief. It's a garbage can. I'm not going to dig through it to find stuff. Like a typical class in, uh, classic point-and-click adventure where you often dig in garbage cans. Biscuit balls! Get your biscuit balls here. Get them while they're hot. What are those things? My own recipe. Came up with it after a little incident that happened recently. Um, what is in them? Whatever's in a biscuit and a little something extra. It's the extra part that worries me. Oh, come on, try it. It won't kill you. I'm gonna try that. They're a buck apiece. Quite a deal if I'd say so myself, and I'm sure your little friend Cindy would <laughs> love to try one. That is disgusting. Um, why would Cindy want to try one? Just a, just a hunch I have. Go on and give her one. I'm sure she'll love it. You're being creepy about it. It's always, I'm always creepy. Just give her a damn biscuit. I don't know if I want to. And how do I make money in this game? By selling stuff to Red? I don't know. Did you drug it or something? What? Of course not. I'm not that kind of janitor. This is something else. Something a bit more entertaining. Um, I could, this would pay her back for the shit that she did to me. Um, this, this feels like a bad thing to do. Oh, I have to have the money on me. Which I don't have. And I can't even do it. If it's a quarter piece, this is a dollar. And then buying would be another action. So I can't even do that action this day. Or this part. How you doing there, Sonny? Want some tasty, nutritious slop for lunch? What's in it? It's an old family recipe. Lots of herbs and spices and salt. And about 89% the principal secret ingredient. 89% is a lot. Oh, it's not that much. Supposedly it keeps the slop in regulation with the government's new health standards. Well, what is it? I can't tell you that. It's a secret. Also, I have no idea what it is. You're feeding us a seasoned mystery ingredient. But the seasoning is so good, it's the best part. I'm not eating it. Well, that's your call. I can't make you eat it. I'd love it if you did, but it's fine. Just move along. All right. So, what are my options then? Because if I if I were to go to buy something from this kid, um, I I need a buck because everything seems to be a buck, right? One, two, three, four, and then the the last action, buying the salad would end the day. It feels like anything I buy would end the day. Maybe what the best option would be is to use this to take money out of my bank, which, I don't know, maybe I should have done that at the beginning. Lesson learned already? And, um, I don't know, and maybe go into the next stage with money. Anything else? Oh, there was a bathroom one. Well, the menu is kind of restricted right now. What, what, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Never mind. I want that bathroom pass. Uh-oh, uh-oh, there we go. Um... Where's the bathroom option? 
No! Where's the bathroom option? I could have sworn I saw one. What, am I crazy? Can I go to the bathroom? Oh, I'm not allowed to let any of you kitties out in the hall during lunch, but maybe you could do me a little something if you wanted me to look the other way. Like what? Well, I seem to have misplaced my glasses. These old eyes can't read the menu without them. See if you can find a pair laying around and I'll let you out. Anything else? Well, that mopey little girl has been paying me to let her out. I don't see why you can, can't get the same deal. Two bucks? I'll just try and find the glasses. What glasses? There's no freaking glasses. Hey, stop, you can't leave until lunch is over. Hmm. Where are her glasses? There's a Monster Mon card under this table. Oh! Pick up the card. Holy shit, what just happened? Why did Lily go? Is there anything else that I could... I, I have no idea what's going on. So I'm looking for her glasses? Do I look in nooks and crannies? You got him over here, Chief? No? I don't know what we gotta do with that. And Lily, she just walked out without getting a pass. I find that to be BS. Maybe one of these kids would like a card? No. Alright, that's the same old, same old. She won't talk to me. And he... alright. Um, I guess I'll take the slop then. There you go, buddy. And don't be shy about coming back for seconds. Plenty of slop to go around. Thanks. Alright, well I've got slop now. I don't know what I do with it. Can I can I give it to one of these kids? Nugget, you want my slop? No. Uh, he doesn't want to sit with me. Everybody's so grouchy. And can, what can I sell? Nothing. I, I, I literally can't sell anything. I'm assuming the options would come up right here. Alright. Okay. I think I think all I can do now is end the the stage. So I'll I'll spend money on those apples then. That's the recess bell, go burn off a delicious slap you just ate. Alright. Lovely. Can I do you four? What do you got? Uh, a Monster Mon card. Hey, I've got one of those. Will you buy it? No, you won't. I don't want anything. All right, let's let's go look around. Anybody? Don't bother me, kid. I'm trying to figure this out. Figure what out? It's this riddle about these stupid duck things. Apparently, if you shake them in the right order, something's supposed to happen. Well, what's the riddle? Go twice the duck that's furthest south, then two blue before red. After return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong and you're dead. <laughs> Wait, is this an actual riddle? Riddle. Then two blue before red. After return to the first duck, then blue. So is this further south? So two, two, one. One? Is that is that it? Good luck solving that. I don't want to get involved. All right. So two. Did it not work? Oh. Two. The, it takes too long for the next question. <laughs> How that killed me? I have no idea. Maybe I can recover from this. It's not ending. The game's not ending. Game? I guess I restart room then? Um, sure. What the f- Alright. One. Two. One. Two. Quack. One. One. That's it, right? Alright, I restarted the room, so I gotta go through this again. Go twice to the 
duct that's further south. Of course, I don't know which way is south, so that is a problem. I assume this was south, but I could be wrong. Then two blue before red. After, return to the first duck, and then blue. Oh, so... Two, two, one, one, one. Okay, oops, wrong button. So, one... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Is, is it... If I do it wrong... Okay, I get it now. If I, if I am wrong, then I die after I start the puddle, puzzle, I guess. Go twice to the duck that's further south, then two blue before red. So two, two, one, one, one. Oops. All right, so one, two, one, two, Quack. one, one. There we go. I got solving the riddle seems to have caused a monster mon card to appear. Pick it up. Hell yeah. Oh, so the cards are different. You see, this one's like a duck, and this one was. Who knows what the hell that one was. Okay, cool. I can't believe you solved it. I have to figure it out faster next time. Goddamn straight you do, you little jerk. This guy looks very creepy. This is a statue of the principal. There is a red glint in his eyes. I know he did it. I don't know why, but I know he did. Okay. There's a gaping hole in there. We're through. Go away. All right, well... I'm not sure I'll ever get anywhere with her again. Can I push him in? Behold, the Nugget Cave. It is very deep and very dark. What secrets does it hold? Do you want to find out? This kid is basically Gollum. <laughs> did that kill me? Did that little shit kill me? I think he did. All right, so in, in this situation... I, I sh there should be some kind of indication that the round or the stage has been completed. When you die, it seems pretty obvious, obvious, but here maybe not as much. But it feels like I have to restart the room. God damn it. Does that mean I gotta do this all over again? Alright. Let me make sure the riddle doesn't change. Uh, no. Okay. One... All right, pick it up. Same card. All right, so that doesn't change. Um, you little shit. I want to push him in here. No. Just trust me, you'll love it. I don't think I will. No one has that ever not loved the Nugget Cave. Let's throw his Nugget in there. Oh, you'll go. One way or another, you'll go. Back away. Get out of here. I'm busy. You don't look busy. I am... Oh, what's the point? It's no fun being a bully when no matter how many kids you beat up, my dad still isn't coming back. A little bit sentimental there. I miss everything about him, even the way he used to drink excessively. Aww. I'm gonna walk away now. Aw, I feel bad. Um, I thought, I thought something popped up here, or am I wrong? Okay, well... Have I talked to the teacher? I don't think I have. Go play while you're still young and thin. <laughs> Can I play on this thing or no? Um, there's a monster mon card lying on the ground. <gasps> I have so many monster mon cards. I feel like I ought to buy. I, because I have a seventy-five cents right now. I could actually buy the other card from him. I'm gonna do that. What can I do you for? I want to buy something. Monster Mon card. That's the Holy Knight card. He's pretty powerful in the world of Monster Mon. He'll run you twelve fifty. I don't have twelve fifty. Jesus Christ, kid. And I can't sell anything. How am I supposed to have twelve fifty by this point in time? Jesus. All right. Is there anything else? 
I like how he didn't eat my slop. Probably can't go over there. I feel like that is all I have for the day. Because most of these kids won't talk to me. Alright. Um... I'll just end the day with money. Buck fifty. That's the bell. Let's all head back inside for show and tell. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? Oh my god. <laughs> I can show cigarettes. I know I shouldn't, but I want to. Is this going to get me, like, beat up? Let's do it. Drugs and school. How horrible. Give those to me right now. Now I don't have to pick some up after school. God damn it. Oh, I'm also sending you to the principal's office. We have some tolerance policy on violence, but a zero tolerance on drugs. Shit. I can put up with a lot in this school. Missing children, violence, a janitor with a questionable past. But one thing I will not stand for in my school is drugs. I know how to handle delinquents like you. Counseling. Oh my god! <laughs> Well, shit. I'm gonna take a while, I guess, and say I have to restart the room. <laughs> yes. Alright, let's not show cigarettes then. What did I bring? Well, uh, a Monster Mon car seems like a good idea then. Those can't be confiscated. She might confiscate a screwdriver. She might, like, call it contraband or something. Um. Uh, can I bring money? No. Bubblegum? I wonder if I can, like, expose Cindy. Um. <laughs> slop. I can't actually believe we make you kids eat this stuff. I'm pretty sure you wouldn't be able to pass a drug test after eating that. Anyway, who's next? Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you had a fun day today. We'll see you all tomorrow. Okay. Is that the end of the day complete? Monster Mon cards. Literally grass. Cyclops Duckling and Oglebop Golem? All right. Money earned $1.50. Oh. So I got $5. I, 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 how did I... Wait a minute. How did I earn $1.50? Is that, is that money earned? How do I have $5 in my piggy bank? Because I've spent money. Do I get money? Alright, so we need some clarification here from the dev. Because, it, let's say, okay, I got $1.50 here. That means I should have $3.50 left in my bank, right? But I spent a couple bucks on cigarettes and a screwdriver. So, I shouldn't have $5. Where did that other money come from? Do you earn money at the end of the day? Which is entirely possible, but it doesn't it doesn't make that clear where that money came from. I think we need clarification there. Monday again? <laughs> Alright, so obviously we have to collect Monster Mon cards here. And there are other items up here we have to collect. So, I get the feeling like it's only Mondays that you play through. And... And every time you play through, maybe you do something different and it changes things. And there's probably a way where you eventually quote unquote win. That's what it looks like to me. I wonder if there's a save. There's no save option. I'm a little worried that closing my game out and then starting over, it'll reset the game. I don't know if that's how it works. Hints. What is hints? Holy shit. You need a special item from Cindy before you can start Nugget's mission. Interesting. Bugs, Monty, and Lily should all be eliminated during lunch. What? You need a special item from Teacher before you complete Bugs' mission. You need to buy three items for Monty before morning time. What is going on? Alright, I don't I don't know if I want these hints right now. Restart day, restart room. Okay, I think that's enough for a first episode though. Um, this game's completely bizarre. I love it, though. I absolutely love it. Um, 
let me know what you think. Is this um, something you want to see more of? Is this uh, a crazy enough game for you guys? Let me know in the comments. Um, again, this is Kindergarten. It's only five bucks on Steam, so um, go ahead and pick it up if you uh, find this pretty entertaining. And um, I guess we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.